It's a story still developing in Norfolk tonight where two men were shot in broad daylight. One of them died. Ten of your sides, Aaron Kelly, picks up the story now live from the police precinct. And Aaron, police are still looking for the person who pulled the trigger. Yeah, we don't have any information right now, Tom, on suspects. Police say they are still putting together the pieces of this puzzle, trying to find out what led to this shooting. Norfolk police spent hours going over the scene at the Ashley Trace apartment complex after they say a shooting left one man dead and sent another to the hospital. Well, I was standing out here cleaning out my trash can. I heard about five or six gunshots go off and within a matter of about three or four seconds, I seen that black vehicle right there come flying around the corner. Robert Brady said a man got out of this Volkswagen and said he'd been shot. But police say there was another man who'd also been shot not far away and later died. Witnesses say they saw him between two trees. This is cell phone video taken moments after the shooting from a man who didn't want to be identified. The ambulance came and started pumping on him, pumping on him. When they put him on the stretcher, I didn't see him moving no more. Enjoy your life like it's your last. Thomas McCoy lives in a unit where it appears police spent some time Wednesday. He told 10 on your side's Andy Fox he didn't know who had been in there. Listen, I'm not saying anything. I just had enough today, okay? Please right. forgive me, all right? But when you came back, did you know who was, had been in there? I can't talk to them. Like I told him, I don't know who was there. I don't, and that's the truth. And this all happened close to Ocean Air Elementary, which went on lockdown temporarily during all of this. Uh, now, as far as the person who was killed, police have not identified him at this point. And as far as the other person who was shot, police say he went to the hospital to have surgery. For now, we're live in Norfolk. Aaron Kelly, 10 on your side.